Derek, was there any part of you that considered just telling him, hell no, I'm not fighting in Texas. I know you think I'm from here. I love it here, but get me at somewhere else. No, not really. Um, I started fighting in Texas, so I got more wins than losses in Texas. So um, I don't think it's no bad luck or nothing like that. Just shit. It is what it is lately. That's what it's, what it's been. That's just the game it is. Yeah. Uh, fighting Sergey, uh, safe to say that when they gave you his name, you had no idea who he was? You already know. You didn't know who he was either. <laughs> don't try to ask me like, I know. I ain't know who he was. I still know who he is. Do he speak English? No. He has a very fine translator with him, though, if you need to get anything across to him. I'm going to have my translator, too. Chain. <laughs> That's my translator watch tomorrow. Okay. So how does that process go? Like the email comes in, there's some name of some dude you've never even heard of, right? I mean, do you just automatically go, yes? Do you ask anybody, like, should we take this? Like, how does that process go? It really don't matter. You know, I fought everyone. So I fought guys that should be champions, you know. And, and I fought guys that should be, like, being a reporter for MMA Junk. <laughs> but, you know, I fought everyone, so it don't matter. Nice. I don't so, care. I don't care. I'm not the best fighter, you know. So, I don't go out there thinking that I'm the best fighter either. So, it don't matter to me. I don't care. Nice. Well, to give you the scouting report, he comes in with three straight first-round knockouts. So, I mean, obviously, you're a knockout fighter as well. I mean, do you want to go like, hey, let's go fireworks, toe for toe? Or is this the one where you go, let's, let's show that blue belt? You know what I mean? Let's break out the blue belt skills and go against this heavy-handed striker. <clears throat> Yeah, I, I showed a little sparks last fight, you know, my takedowns. And we might do a little blue belt action first round. We don't, we don't know. We'll see. We'll just see how it goes. You know, I prefer just getting the win any means necessary, though. Nice. Last thing for me, Derek. I mean, obviously, we know you fight for your family, right? It seems like you've done pretty well for yourself so far and everything is good. What motivates you at this point? I mean, is it still like I still got to put money away for the family in the future? Or is it that knockout record? Is it about the fans that you have? Like, what, what motivates you these days? Um, it's still the money. You know, shit, inflation. You didn't see the gas price? Shit, you, um, what is it, $7, $6, something like that in Vegas? Yeah, it's rough. It's like 6 bucks in Vegas. Yeah, so it's even more. I was actually excited to see the prices here. It's nice. Yeah, it just went down last week, yeah. What if you get the Mega Millions, though? Then do you still keep fighting? It's a billion dollars now. Mega Millions, I'm going to buy the UFC. <laughs> now I'm going to talk so much shit to the reporters. Ooh, I'm going to dog y'all ass out like y'all do as fighters. Ooh, yeah. Are you not a fan of us reporters, Derek? Fuck y'all. <laughs> y'all talk so much shit about me for no reason. And I'm sitting up here telling y'all ass the truth. I don't give a fuck about this fighting shit. Y'all sitting up here telling me, oh, I don't think Derek got it. Motherfucker, I've been telling y'all, fuck y'all. <laughs> shit. See, it is what it is. I don't care. I feel like you're one of the more popular fighters amongst the media. Nah, man. I don't even like y'all. Oh, nice. But old boy right here, um, you lost some weight, though. You're looking good, man. A little bit. I got, to, I got a ways to go, but we starting. But you lost weight. You see? You're getting a little neck now. You're starting to see like the um the outline of your neck. Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> so you're looking good, man. Yeah. Maybe it's the shirt. The worst though. compliment I've ever no, gotten in my life, dog. No, no, maybe it's maybe it's the blue shirt you usually wear. Yeah, but yeah. the black oh okay, they do say the black shirt make you look skinny. Right. Okay. We'll switch it up. Right. It's like having Sean Strickland back in here, just roasting us. <laughs> no, no offense. No offense, but you know, everybody it. a little sensitive nowadays. Just a little preview of when you buy the UFC, what we're up against. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to light your ass so I got all kinds of blueberry muffin jokes on you. <laughs> but uh, next question, man. <laughs> I don't even have it. <laughs> uh, Derek over here. Nobody knows. <laughs> <laughs> My bad. What is the weirdest question that you've ever been asked? <sighs> I don't know. I don't know. Okay. I think they all wear it. Where I get my name from, I guess. The Black Beast. I always think it's a setup every time they ask me that. Especially a foreign, from a foreign country. Because they automatically think it's something racist. So, 
I'll be trying not to feed them too much into it because they already, you know, from Russia, Germany, and all that. They, they're born off that swastika stick. But, man, don't be asking me no question. Next question, man. That's it? No, I got I go one for you, Derek. Right here. All right. I saw Where video. you from, BT? <laughs> Huh? Come on now, MMA junkie. Oh, okay, oh. all right. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I saw in a, a video you did recently. You were at a car show or something like that. And a guy interviewed you, and uh, you were around one of your expensive vehicles that you own. Can't say that, man. <laughs> can't say that. And he, he asked you, what "I'm you trying think? to get a new contract. You can't talk my about bad, my, my expensive." My bad. It was, it was a modest vehicle. Okay, I think it was like a Civic or something. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Um, Paper tags. <laughs> yeah. Okay. But uh, he asked you what you did for a living, and uh, I think uh, fighting was the last thing that you mentioned. I think you actually said you were a part-time fighter. So, mm-hmm. um, how how actually engaged are you at this point in terms of, you know, your fighting career, part-time, full-time, okay. that sort of thing? No, actually, um, I changed camps. I made a new camp now, and. We just been having fun. I've been enjoying the process of training. I used to um, not like to even drive to the gym. Now I try to get there early, you know, like at least one minute early than I usually do. Right, Shane? I don't, have I been late this camp? Uh, no comment. <laughs> oh, okay. All right. Fuck him. Get the camera off him. Get the camera off him. Back on me. But anyways... I go to the gym early. I don't care what they say. I go to the gym early. I leave late. You know, I don't got the key to it, but I still leave late. And I get the work done. And I've been having fun in the gym. Been a while since I had fun in, in the gym. So this is going to be your 25th UFC fight, your, your silver anniversary, so to speak. You know, we've had some other folks try to hang around for 50, like Donald Cerrone. Will you be around that long? <sighs> I don't know. That's kind of hard. 50 fights? He had 50 fights? UFC fights? Across UFC and Zufa. Like uh, um, WEC. I don't know. I don't know. I never thought about that. That's crazy. Were you, were you aware this was your 25th? No. That's crazy, too. <laughs> because I know there's a lot of people didn't even think I would even make it past my second fight, you know? But it's crazy to be even fighting for, like, my 25th fight this week, 25th. And that's crazy. And now I feel like now that I'm finally training the way I'm supposed to be training and doing everything I'm supposed to be doing these last few years. And I feel like if I would have been doing that from the get-go, I'd still be where I'm at. So, yeah. <laughs> Fuck it. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Thank you, but for real though, you did look like you lost some weight. A little bit, a little bit. Man, I'm saying, you lost weight. You lost weight. All right, I got you. I'm serious. You lost some weight. 